Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing a video on all the fuel furnaces you can use in Java Edition. Java Edition is just the PC and not Windows 10, so if you are not playing on the PC, you're Bedrock and I'm doing a video for Bedrock Fuels real soon. If however you still want to watch this video, some things will apply to you, but the burning time, the amount and also if the fuel works will be different for both versions. This current footage is from the continuation of my last video, so make sure you check it out if you want to see what happened at the start of this Cake Wars. In this video, I will be providing you with a visual image in the corner somewhere of whatever block or item I am talking about. And also, I will provide you with how many things that fuel source can burn. If you're looking for more info, let me know in the comments below and I will make a more in-depth video if you want it. So, let's get into it. The first fuel source is the lava bucket and this is by far the best as it gives you a hundred blocks of smelting per one lava bucket. You do get to keep the bucket but the lava does disappear. So if you have a nether portal nearby this is probably the best fuel source. The next thing is a block of coal and a block of coal is made out of normal coal of course and it can burn 80 blocks. The next one is a dried kelp block. Now to get dried kelp block you need to take normal kelp, put it in a furnace, wait for it to cook and then use the dried kelp to make a kelp block and this will burn 20 items. This does not include the items that were used up to make the kelp block. The next one is a blaze rod and this will cook 12 items. If you haven't already noticed, I'm only talking about one item. So if you put in one piece of coal, then the amount I tell you is how much that one piece of coal will burn. No more, just the one. So you can figure out the maths yourself if you want to know how many items more will do. The next one is coal and this burns eight items. And also something that should be familiar to you is a char coal and this also burns only eight items. Okay, the next one is any boat except made from the nether wood. I don't know if you can actually make a boat from nether wood. Um, but this burns six items. The next one is a scaffolding and this only burns two items. The next one is any log or stripped log except for nether wood. And this burns 1.5. The next one is any wood or stripped wood, again not nether wood, in fact you can't use nether wood for any of these wooden things, okay, it just does not burn. And this burns 1.5 blocks. Okay, this footage by the way is from my Let's Play world and the playlist should appear at the end of this video. The next thing is any wooden slab, again, no nether wood, and this burns 0 0.75 items. The next one is any wooden stairs, which burns 1.5, and then a, any wooden pressure plate, which again burns 1.5. Make sure that it's not nether wood. Next one is any wooden button, and this burns 0 0.5. I don't think at this point I need to tell you that you can't use nether wood. Just remember that. You cannot use nether wood for anything wooden to burn with. Any wooden trapdoor, any fence gate, any wooden fence, and any ladder, which all burn 1.5 items. These next items also burn 1.5 items, and they are the crafting table, the cartography table, the fletching table, the smithing table, the loom, the bookshelf, the lectern, the composter, a normal chest, a trapped chest, and a barrel. Again, these all burn 1.5 items. Also 1.5 items, I know there is such a lot of them, is the daylight detector, the jukebox, the note block, any banner, the crossbow, and a normal bow, a fishing rod too. 
Whew, we should take a little break, shouldn't we? That is such a lot, and there's still more to come. So I hope you're enjoying my footage. I know it may be a little teeny bit boring, but this is the stuff that people, when they're doing Let's Play Worlds, have to do anyway. And it's just interesting to see some background footage. Let's continue. These things burn at one item. So we have a wooden door, any sign, a wooden pickaxe, a wooden shovel, a wooden hoe, a wooden axe, a wooden sword. Next ones are the things that burn at 0 0.5 items and that is a bowl, any sapling, a stick, and any wool. Only two more to go, thank goodness. When I was researching this, I couldn't believe there were this many fuels. Now, the next one is any carpet, and this burns 0 0.335 items. And the last one is bamboo, which burns at 0 0.25 items. Some important notes before the end of this video that are super important, and please do not miss out on these are that anything that I said any wood works, you cannot use nether wood for these. So you cannot use warped or crimson wood. Also another thing is that when you're using stuff in a blast furnace or smoker, things get used up twice as fast, meaning that if in a furnace a type of fuel will burn one block, it'll only burn half in a blast furnace or smoker. I hope that makes sense. Hope you guys enjoyed my video. All links to my other channels and Twitter and Discord are in the description. Check them out if you like. And also, like I said at the beginning of the video, I'm doing a bedrock version of Fuels soon. So stay tuned for that. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, guys. Bye!